Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to BYB Tactical. And today we're gonna talk about the Boulder Mini. Um, here you go, looks like that. And the reason why I got this light, I already did videos and I already have multiple lights for the PL Mini Valkyrie 2. However, I don't know if you remember my last video, I got the incorrect holster for the P320 full size, uh, which is this one right here. The original one I bought was for the Boulder Mini. Um, so Works has sent me another holster and pretty much it was for the PL Mini Valkyrie 2. So I was like, you know what, I'll just get the Boulder Mini and Boulder Mini and see what it offers and what's better about it. It's only 10 or $15 more than the PL Mini Valkyrie 2. So I was like, you know what, I'll just get it. Why not? And I took advantage of a whole like sale that they had going on these past few weeks. So yeah, let's talk about the Boulder Mini. So what's for the 10 to $15 more, what makes it better or I guess different than the PL Mini Valkyrie 2? So to make it very easy for you, it pretty much has a laser on top of the light so there's the laser um, has three different settings on it so you can either have a laser or you can have laser and light or you can have just the light so that's up to you and the settings are very easy it's literally like a little trigger on the back I don't know if you can see that but it pretty much labels it for you you want just a light laser light or just laser so it's that easy now just quick things on old light products what makes them better or not better but what makes them kind of what i what i'm drawn to them for i'm not a leo i am not military i am not you know any tactical guy i literally just an everyday guy that you know conceals and carries and looking for a light now for my firearm so one of the things that really drew me to Olac products is the fact that it is rechargeable by simply doing that. You don't have to worry about having, you know, extra batteries laying around or having to recharge your light in a night or anything like that. It's literally as easy as one, two, three, magnetize it, start charging, and you're good to go. And I don't know if you've seen my videos before on Works Holsters. If you haven't, check them out. I'll definitely put a link onto them right here. Um, but what makes Works pretty good for old like products and the p320 specifically is the fact that it makes it easy for you to charge your battery so here is the works holster and here is a little slot cut off that works holsters did that pretty much makes it easy for you to charge your battery and pretty much if you ever need to use it it doesn't interfere I have the pretty much magnet still here um, another thing that makes pretty much works holsters really great is the fact that it is for all sizes, not just full size or compact, sub compact, but pretty much all of them. Um, so again, check out my last video on works holsters if you're not familiar with them. Um, I would definitely check them out if you're interested in buying an Olight product with the P320 combo. They also do offer it for other uh, firearm manufacturers, but I can only speak on SIG because that's the only one I bought from them. So yeah, guys. So, and another thing, like I said, Pretty much what makes it like 10 15 dollars difference from the pl mini valkyrie 2 is it does have the laser now i will say i have not tried the limits of the, of the laser to see how far it goes i do live in a pretty urban area so i can't just go outside and start flashing a laser down the street i probably get some bad attention and i don't want that so but if you are interested to see how this light performs at night um, which I did I did a video in my backyard I'll put the video right here so you could check that out it was on the PL mini Valkyrie 2 and like I said the PL mini Valkyrie 2 has the same dimensions as the Boulder mini it just had the Boulder mini just offers a laser with it for 10 15 dollars more so it does have 600 lumens I believe on a full charge it lasts up to an hour hour and a half if I'm not mistaken uh, it recharges pretty quick now I will say um, I don't recommend but I do it I don't care so the charger it comes as a USB right it doesn't come in a box so you have to have your own box if you have Apple products or even if you have the new uh, like those really fast charging I don't know Samsung I don't know I don't know what they're called but I have the Apple one that you charge for an iPad if you have that bigger box this thing charges like in 10 minutes um, not even kidding actually less than that I remember I put it up when it was completely dead when I first got it, it literally had a little bit of juice I tried in the backyard and it died I plugged it up and I remember I went to go like eat something I can't remember what and then next thing you know, I came back it was already fully charged so if you do have that it's just kind of like a tip um, I don't know if it's recommended or not but I just do it why not but yeah guys that's all I have for you today um, 
please, before you leave, like and subscribe, and also hit the bell at the bottom, so therefore you get uh, notifications for future videos. And until next time, guys.